well my dear students the course is labor policy pakistan and the topic is british agri cultural revolution aapko pata hai ki jo industrial revolution hai wo british yani england mein took place hua aur sabse zyada tarakki duniya mein british ne ki aur phir wahan se sari technology jo hai wo dusre mulkon mein phaili aaiye ब्रिटिश एग्रीकल्चरल रेवोल्यूशन के मुतलक कुछ बातें डिस्कस करते हैं डियर स्टूडेंट्स ब्रिटिश एग्रीकल्चरल रेवोल्यूशन की वजह से जो एग्रीकल्चरल प्रोड्यूस हैं उनमें मैनीफोल्ड इजाफा हुआ माई डियर स्टूडेंट्स एग्रीकल्चरल आउटपुट ग्रीव faster than the population over the century to 1770 and thereafter productivity remained among the highest in the world iski wajah se kya hua ke food supply badh gayi and this increased in the food supply contributed to the rapid growth of population in england and wales from 5.5 million in 1700 to over 9 million by 1801 what an increase dear students though domestic production gave way increasingly to food imports in the 19th century as the population more than tripled to over 35 million the students however historians continue to dispute when exactly such a revolution took place and of what it consisted rather than a single event G E Minge states that there were a profusion of agricultural revolutions one for two centuries before 1650 another emphasizing the century after 1650 a third for the period 1750 to 1780 and a fourth for the middle decades of the 19th century my dear students this has led more recent historians to argue that any general statements about the agriculture revolution are difficult to sustain my dear students during the period of british agricultural revolution major developments and innovations include norfolk four course crop rotation which was fodder crop particularly turnips and clover replaced leaving the land fallow f a w l o w it's a tricky word which means uncultivated the students as a matter of fact the dutch improved the chinese plow so that it could be pulled with fewer oxen or horses the common rights as regards the removal of common rights they created a system to establish exclusive ownership of land dear students moreover there was a development of a national market free of tariffs tolls and customs barriers during the agricultural revolution in england transportation infrastructures such as roads canals and later railways were built for the facilitation of the markets and the people 
by the students one important change in farming method was the move in crop rotation to turnips and clover in place of fallow hope you have understood the topic thank you very much indeed